Last Monday, at the beginning of the series, I offered a definition of prayer as opening to God. And today I want to continue to examine what prayer is. I think it's important that we pause and we think about prayer. I am told that Google searches for prayer and spirituality and meditation have drastically risen in these weeks of lockdown. And this says something about us human beings that are searching, and prayer is ultimately about our search. Last week, I said that when we come to prayer, we seek to be open to God, as we are. We open ourselves and let God take the lead. We need to remember, and this goes against our human inclination, that God is the initiator of prayer and not us. Jesus tells us in John's Gospel, You have not chosen me, I chose you. Or St. Paul too in his letter to the Romans tells us that it is the Spirit that prays in us because we do not know how to pray. Our encounter with God is God's work and not ours. And so we often think and believe that it is up to us. And all we need to do is show up, open ourselves, have the intention of being with God, and let God work. We open ourselves to God by offering God who and where we truly are, what we think and feel at that moment. And prayer is also a dialogue, an encounter between two people. We speak and we listen because a good listener is also a good prayer. God cannot speak with us if we don't listen to God. And God cannot know what is going on if we don't speak to God. And so listening is integral to prayer. Let's now dig a little bit deeper. We might wonder, is prayer relevant to and for us if we just need to show up and wait for God? Could we not be doing something more productive? That's our big trap, the idol of productivity. And this goes deep into our human consciousness because we've been formed to believe that our value, that our usefulness, our goodness is revealed in our ability to be productive. If by relevant we mean useful to us as a means of getting what we want, being productive, accomplishing our own ends, or as we probably mean when we say the words, your will be done, most of the time meaning my will be done by you, God, then prayer is not relevant. Prayer is not a tool for need filling or problem solving. We are often tempted to use God as a last resort when all else fails. And when we see our prayer as a useful tool, we completely misunderstand the essence of prayer. And sadly, so much of our catechesis and our own formation in prayer has tended towards this kind of understanding of prayer. Just like love and friendship are not a means to an end, nor is prayer. Prayer is a relationship to God, one in which God remains the protagonist of the encounter. Prayer is absolutely relevant if we understand that it is not on our terms or about our goals, but rather the search for God's creative work in us and in the world. Prayer is not relevant to the goals we set, but relevant to our search for God's designs for us and for our world. In other words, prayer is at the level of our deeper, this existential search for meaning and for fulfillment. If you would like to be guided in an audio meditation on being open to God, I invite you to visit our website and click on the sidebar where it says Guided Meditations and select the meditation entitled Opening to God.